Authorities in Italy are urging tourists not to cancel their holidays in the country, despite a sharp rise in the number of people contracting the virus. Italy has seen the largest cluster of cases in Europe, but these holidaymakers are taking things in their stride. I'm from Poland. Yeah, so we will save. Yeah, I know that it's not, not, not a lot of people now, but everything is okay. So we travel from Torino to Milan, and then tomorrow we will be in, in Bergamo. I did not honestly know that the virus was here until I got here and the locals were telling me about it, but no, I'm not afraid at all. In Germany, a doctor working in the pediatric and youth department at the University Medical Center in Hamburg has contracted the disease. The doctor returned from his holiday in Trentino, in Italy, at the weekend, which is not a risk area according to the current definition. He went on duty on Monday, felt healthy, worked for a day and a half, and then felt symptoms of the illness. Globally, there have been more than 83,000 confirmed cases of the disease, with the majority in China. In Europe, there have been just over 800 people with the illness, with 19 deaths. Meanwhile, at the Cray Air Force Base northeast of Paris, it's reported that eight people have tested positive for the disease. Two of them are said to be in a serious condition. All military personnel have been tested and travel restrictions put in place. Nick Wells, Euronews.